you're looking to buy a laptop, the first thing you need to decide is how much you want to spend and stick to it. There are three main types of laptop, budget, mainstream and ultra portable. Each is progressively more expensive. Budget laptops are great for general use online and word processing, but they can be slow for more intensive tasks such as video editing. They also tend to be heavier, have worse quality screens and more of a no frills look and feel than more expensive models. Mainstream laptops make the step up with bigger storage capacities, better processors and more memory and are great all-rounders for entertainment including photos and video. Ultra portables are thin, light and powerful and tend to feature flash storage which is faster but smaller than traditional hard drives. They're great for carrying around and are getting cheaper all the time but they're still an expensive choice at the moment. If you want to play high-end games, it's important to look into what you're buying. Very few laptops come with the ability to play intensive games at decent quality. You'll have to splash out on a more expensive model to get added graphic support from Nvidia or AMD. But when you buy a new laptop, the main choice for many is whether you plump for an Apple Mac running OS X or a PC running Windows 8. Google's Chrome OS is a new alternative, but it is a more limited operating system than you get with a PC or a Mac. If you've heard a bit about Windows 8, the rumours are true. It is a fundamentally different way of using a PC and it is better suited for touch, though it's perfectly usable with a keyboard and trackpad. The great thing about Windows 8 is that many new PCs are shipping with touchscreens and as well as touchscreens on traditional laptops, we're also seeing a whole load of new hybrid designs with slide-out keyboards as well as Windows 8 tablets with detachable keyboards. So what should you look for inside your laptop? In terms of memory, we'd recommend at least 4 gigabytes. That's plenty for pretty much all computing tasks. For your hard drive, most laptops are now shipping with at least 500 gigabytes of storage. That's plenty for lots of apps, as well as music, photos, and videos. The processor is the hardest choice. Intel processors are the most common, although some laptops are available with AMD processors. Intel's chips are the Core i3, i5, and i7. We'd recommend you ignore any older types of Intel processors such as Celeron or Pentium and go straight for the Core i3. As you'd expect, Core i5 is better and is the best compromise of performance and price. We'd recommend Core i7 only if you'll be attempting intensive tasks such as video editing or gaming. Before buying, make sure you check out TechRadar's Top 25 Laptops article for a constantly updated list of the best laptops around.